All right, guys, we're back. And I remember I told you I've been working bumpers on a train retreat. For some reason, when it's my own dog, it's harder for me to do it. And I've sort of plateaued, but I'm pushing myself. And you've got to do this at home. And, and that's why I can empathize with you guys at home that are training them. Because you kind of plateau. And if you're really going to train the dog, you know, there's people that say you're not going to put any pressure on them. So that's really not reality. That would be like saying you don't put any pressure on an athlete or you don't put any pressure on people in college or in, in a job place or anything. We don't put any pressure. That's not even realistic. But what, what I've got is, what I would say at this time is I've got kind of a quasi hold. So what I'm doing is I'm doing my paper fetch. Sit. Oh, you precious. Leave it. Precious, precious dog. So it, that's, you know, I, I've got it that in a sequence. And I don't, and I, I know you guys have seen me do other ones with trained to retrieve, and I am working towards that point. I'm just taking me forever. Remy's going to be able to progress a little bit faster. Once I get Remy going, I'll be more motivated. All right, so what I'm doing is I'm holding my pager down. Fetch. He's got it. You know what, if anything, good. Yay. Sit. Oh, you precious, leave it. And, and that, it's, it's just sequential. If you said the train, your training is very situational, I'd say you're very perceptive. Anyway, I'm working on it. Bye, guys.